The Lady Alisa. Panthers also playing for a championship on the softball side. They played North Vermilion. After striking out the side in the top of the first, Haley Chambers starts things off for the Panthers by lacing a double out to right center. But she would end up stranded thanks to some defense by the Lady Rocks. This fly ball goes out to left field and check out Michaela Kinnear. Track it down and lay out to make a tremendous grab. Not enough though for the Falcons. Chambers pitching too much. The Panthers get the shutout, 5-0. Want some more softball? How about the Terre Haute South softball bash? It's the Braves against Ron Colley. Braves down two with two on, and Shelby Scamahorn hits one hard into right, enough to score Kelsey Marlowe and Sierra Hall on the play. That would tie it up. Then Caitlin Pluta steps in, and she knocks one the opposite way into left field. That one would score Marissa Stout, put the Braves on top three to two. But Ron Colley's offense was too much today. The Braves drop it 11 to seven. Over on another diamond, Terre Haute North and South Putnam were going at it. North down 2-0 late, trying to stay close. Brooke Fetcher smokes one. Look at the hop from Haley Travioli, and she's cat-like to double off the runner at first on the play. But in the seventh, Betcher came on to pitch, and she was very effective, mowing down North hitters very quickly. Look at the soft ground ball back to her. Patriots fall to South Putnam 2-0.